is Community Connection. Thanks for joining us for this Community Connection Spotlight. We have Dan Thomas with the Montana Bale Trail What the Hay Contest here in the MTN studio. Thanks for, so much for being here. Yes, thank you, Keely. Appreciate okay. that. So we're here to talk about um, an annual event, the What the Hay Contest and Bale Trail, which is a very popular event um, here in North Central Montana. It is, it is. It's, uh, it's a really big thing for our community. And when the school, the Hobson Public School was approached uh, last year at the What the Hay, to take it over, we were excited to do so. Um, and so the Hobson School has, t has officially taken over the Montana Bale Trail What the Hay, and all of the proceeds that we will raise uh, from this day will go towards uh, the school. So any extracurricular activities such as BPA, FFA, our music, uh, any out-of-pocket uh, teacher expenses. Uh, so it's a, it's a really good thing. It's all for the kids and it's a great thing for our community. So we're, we're excited to take it over and be part of it. All so. right, and when, uh, if we could get some details, when and where uh, this is taking place? So, so the event itself begins on September 9th. Mm -hmm. And so the What the Hay, what the Hay Bale Trail will begin at 10 o'clock in the morning and it'll go until four o'clock in the evening. Uh, we will have uh, football players and basketball players uh, uh, handing out uh, ballots at the entrances to the Bale Trail, which will be at Wyndham, and then also at uh, uh, Hobson. And so also in Hobson, uh, we're, we will have vendors set up that will be having uh, food booths, uh, arts and crafts, and, and that type of thing. And also, they, we will have a, uh, um, a Midway Cafe that will be in Hobson. Okay. There's going to be a lot of activities going on. It's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, Friday night, the night prior, the uh, Utica Rod and Gun Club will have a dinner uh, followed by a dance at the Oxen Yoke at 8 o'clock that night. And then um, Sunday morning is when the actual uh, process begins. The Masons will have a breakfast in the morning for, at 7.30 and then the Bale Trail starting and just festivities uh, happening all day long. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Wow, sounds like a really jam-packed weekend full of activities for everyone in the family. It will. Sure. It's a great family activity and we really encourage for you, you listeners that are listening, if you're creative, you're artistic, we are always looking for folks to come out and create bales. And so we will provide the land, we will provide the bales for that. And so please feel free to come out and do that. And, and then also for any individuals or businesses that are listening, this is a fundraiser for our, our school kids. And so if uh, you're inclined to donate to the cause, we'd be more than happy to do that uh, for businesses and individuals. That can be done on a, a, a tax exempt basis. Uh, and then certainly accepting uh, donations uh, during the bail trail itself. So okay, yeah. for those uh, those creative those who are creative in the audience listening right now, um, or for businesses that are interested, uh, what will what are you guys looking for in a hay bale? And then you guys provide that bale too that they can yes. that they can uh, yeah. decorate. Absolutely, we we will provide the bales. Uh, we'll provide the land in which to do it. So all you have to do is bring your creative ideas and then whatever supplies that you need to uh, formulate your bale. But okay. anything goes, um, as long as it's in good taste and it's in family fun, um, we just highly encourage you come out and do a bale. We'd love to have you part of it. So. All right, sounds yes. good. A lot of good information. Um, and more information can be found on our websites as well, KRTV and KXLH.com. Thank you so much for being here, Dan. Yes, thank you, Keely. Appreciate that. Thank you.